In the story of the game, we're investigating these mysteries so that we go, oh, it's Azatop, and then we save the world. I am Lola Hayes, the actress, who is out to prove everyone wrong in a comeback tour. I am Diana Stanley, a redeemed occultist. I'm a reformed cultist, definitely reformed. I have been typecast as the beardy dude, and I'm not sure why. Crazy old man. Yeah, yeah, I can I can get behind that. Uh, hello everyone, my name is Lily Chen. She is a woman of few words and flying fists. I'll go shopping first. Okay. Boom. Shop it up. You run headlong through the tunnel. <laughs> what is an astronomer doing in the sewers? And you gain a leg injury condition. God. Ha <laughs> ha. Pat, come on, we need you two-legged. This is gonna stay on the board. There's a rumor, an ongoing rumor. Ah, <sighs> rumors suck. Are you uh, going to Atlantis to try to resolve the rumor? Yes. You know, wanna go to Hawaii? Not a big deal. Atlantis, it's a panty dropper. Did. This rumor's gone. Woo! Being a cultist isn't so bad after. No, reformed. Definitely oh, go shopping! Oh, it's all like, yeah. So if you wanna know what privilege looks like, to go visit Lola. So here's here's the thing. I've got two clues. We want to get me to Tunguska as quickly as possible. I'm feeling really nervous right now. We've made virtually no progress toward actually solving this mystery. Now we have two characters in the location where the mystery needs to be solved with enough clues to solve the mystery. We could solve this mystery by the end of this turn or we could be in a world of hurt and really fall behind. It's now, uh, now it's on to you to encounter things. So. This is what happens now. You make an observation test. And if you pass, you can spend two clues to place an Eldritch token on the card. Okay, so I have a plus one for observation. Great. Oh, you did it! I did it! Yes! With my world comeback tour, the message that I want to send to the children is you can do it. If you believe it, you can achieve it. So, I love those jazz hands. Nice yeah. work. Yeah. Yeah. Actress. <laughs> you know, that's a that's a real rags to riches story. Her coming out of the asylum for her big comeback tour. That's that's good drama. Diane, Gaty McClose a lot. <sighs> Let's do it. You step into the abyss. Sounds good. Naturally. Yeah. The nightmares seem intent on keeping you here in the darkness. Less you, good. You do your best to continue climbing out of these terrible depths mm, without you. alerting them to your presence. Okay. <laughs> Observation. Okay, plus four. We used to be buds. There nice. we go, yeah, there it is. I got it, yeah. I got it. You, got it. you reach up. the trap door that leads from the abyss into Sarcomand. Sarcomand? Sarcomand. Sarcomand. Yeah, sure. Sarcomand. The journey has Ooh. only strengthened your resolve and you improve your will. Woo! Your sad, sad, shattered will. I'm not gonna go back! <laughs> now it will require all of your strength to push open the door. Uh -oh. Strength, minus one. <laughs> <laughs> ah, nailed it. You, I've been doing CrossFit, so. <laughs> <laughs> you are able to escape and close the gate. Boom! Nice work, man! All right, Charlie. Are you gonna encounter that space oh, or what? sure. A copy of the Necronomicon is kept at the University of Buenos Aires, but the librarian tells you that it's not available for viewing at this time. Probably because I took it. Absurd! <laughs> you try to convince him of the book's importance, so use your influence. I <laughs> one influence. Who knows her? I really want her to work. <laughs> you don't have anything that helps you <laughs> help that thing? Sir, why, would you like to sit down? <laughs> I would like to sit down. Can you spend a sanity to re-roll? <laughs> I can spend sanity. <laughs> 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 Almost. <laughs> Almost. Oh, I just love the sputtering, angry guy. In Don't the you game. know who I am? Yeah. All right, so I'm going to make an observation test. This could be it. We could solve this 
Mystery. Okay. Hmm. I get to reroll a die. You don't. You don't have to spend the clues. You, you're still there. Tungusta is beautiful in springtime. Yeah, just try again. The trees are flowering. We can't all get it on the first try. <laughs> <laughs> you hang your head in exhaustion and frustration. You jump suddenly when a hand rests on your shoulder. To your relief, you turn to find the local priest. Have faith, my child, he tells you. Your good works have not gone unseen. Your brave acts are making a difference. The lead investigator gains a blessed condition. Blessed. You're blessed, grab that blessed condition. I'm blessed. Being blessed is great because it ups your chances of success from roughly 33% to 50%. Four, five, and sixes count as successes on Whoa. your test. Whoa! And uh, you always want to keep and hold blessed if, if you can. So, Stephanie, you are the lead investigator. <laughs> bless me! <laughs> bless me! A chew! Oh, bless you! Oh, thank you! I will thank do you. that! Not only am I an altruistic person, let's be honest, he's bad at rolling dice. Shall I go investigate the unexplored part of the world? All right. What are you gonna do over there, Diane? I think I will shop and uh -huh. rest so okay. that I can get back some of my, my health. Yeah. So All I right. need two Good influence. Luck. Shopping. I got one. I'll get the pocket watch. And um, what are you gonna do? Um, I'm gonna shop yeah. with my one influence. Yep. Normally, I like to play like the gear up character. You know, I wanna be gaining spells or items. I wanna power up. And Norman has one influence. He is utterly useless in terms of buying things. You know, if I was smart. Can you buy anything for one? No, but I could go into debt. Yeah, you could. Not maybe the wisest long-term choice, but I will happily I will happily do that just to, to get something I can use to hit a bad guy with. I'm gonna take a debt condition, I'm gonna get the ax. All right. And then I'm moving into the Amazon. Okay. Um, I think that I can't shop on account of I'm in Tunguska, but I don't wanna leave. Mm -hmm. Oh, you can. What, uh, what else can I do? What? You have this super tome. Oh, 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 I got the tome tome. And you're very sane. Yeah, okay. Yeah! <laughs> <Whoa. laughs> oh <my God. laughs> amazing. Okay, all right. That's okay. That's great. Um, I'll take two clues. That's so. Um, that's cute. great. And now I will rest. Hashtag um, blessed. Yeah. Hashtag are. blessed for reals. The terrain ahead of you looks impassable, but going around it would take too long. You'll need to find some way to move forward. Make an observation test. So gain plus one, so that will be, I get to roll three. And oh, I and that's double success. Flying colors. If you pass, you discover a path. Move one space. Hey! Hey! What's I'll move up? to that, I'll move to the clue. Alaska. Welcome to Alaska. Um, <laughs> Diane. Doctors ask you to observe a trephination. <laughs> that's <laughs> not smart. <laughs> <laughs> They pull away a piece of the person's skull and you examine the brain with observation. I lick it. <laughs> I'm for it. Did you say you like it or you lick it? I licked it and it didn't work. Nothing <laughs> happened. Because you're supposed to use your eye, not your tongue. <laughs> I decide to gamble a clue for a clue because why not? I'm crazy. Okay. No! You could, you could spend another clue. Ha, ha, ha. I'll do it. If you fail, you don't see the Shan, and it overpowers your mind, and we would shuffle a solved mystery back into the deck. Oh! But we have not solved it yet, so oh! we do not. So There's my failure was actually a future success. There's a reason for yeah. it. Hang on, guys. I got to go back in time and fail that previous roll. Okay, I'm oh, wait, back. You did. That was great. <laughs> um, what are you gonna do, uh, Professor? The Amazon. You've heard rumors that a particular secret of the ancients is visible from the top of a hill. You find that climbing the hillside, for many reasons, is not an easy task. <laughs> Can I use my axe as, a, as some sort of crutch? <laughs> Come on. 
I will spend I sanity. Good idea. Yeah. Yes! yes! You made it up the Top hill. Of the hill. It's pretty good. Yeah. You find a lost treasure. Gain one artifact. <gasps> From this height, you can survey the land for miles. So roll for observation minus one. Yes. Hey. You see drawings that are hundreds of feet across. Gain one clue. Oh! oh, oh, oh. Sweet. This is I, my this is the beginning of my comeback tour. <gasps> and I get my very own tome. Hey, congratulations! Ooh, What's your tome do? I get the Necronomicon. Oh! oh come I on! Test, you held out for the good one. I test lore, and if I pass, I may spend sanity, which is my bag, yeah. uh, and I gain two spells. Guys, I'm here, and I'm going to once again attempt to. Tungus guys, Tunguska. It's observation, you can do okay. it. On a four, five, or six, and I get a reroll. <gasps> Yay! Guess what, everybody? We have solved ah! the seed of the Damon St Sultan! <laughs> the Damon Sultan. I never thought we would get this far. I'm gonna be honest, I thought I was definitely going to somehow destroy this whole thing. But we're one mystery down. Yes! Ah! Yes! 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 Ah! yes! We okay, did it. all right. Time. I don't understand this. This is why I joined the cult in the first place. All right. Okay. 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 Um, so then, at the end of the mythos phase, if there are yep. eldritch tokens on this card equal yep. to half, solve this mystery. Okay. I'm so nervous about drawing this card because we have worked so hard to solve this mystery. There are cards in the mythos deck that will, say, put a mystery card right back in, or take an elder sign off. He writes the price on a piece of paper and slides it across the table. It's more than you can afford, but you don't have any other options and this greedy lout knows it. The uh, reckonings. Reckon, the reckoning. Yeah, so let's reckon that monster first. What happens? Move this monster to the nearest space containing an investigator. <gasps> then an investigator on that space immediately encounters it. Two, Two three. three to you. Voila. Yeah. Best Kay. of luck. Good thing Kay. you got All only right. one. I'm like here. Injury. I'm All ready. Right. All right, injury. And I got to roll two to beat it. Okay, so I take two sanity damage. All right. Oh, this is Kick not... its ass. A success. One, All right? So, so I'll do one. a point of damage. Yep. Okay. Great. It could have been worse. Yeah, okay. Reckonings. Do you have any reckonings? Nope. Do you have any reckonings? All the reckonings. Oh, you got a lot of reckonings. Test <laughs> physical. Yep. Woo! Hey, you okay. okay, you passed. Now test Shake your, it off. Uh, debt. So my debt. A, 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 <laughs> hold on, this is a result of my debt, right? Okay. Yeah. A sorcerer holds me down and carves a symbol into my forehead. These credit card companies, you think they're bad now, but uh, the one thing you can say for them is that probably no one will ever kneel on your chest and cut an arcane symbol into your forehead. Maybe with American Express, but the others, almost certainly not. Time to pay what you owe, he says. What's in your wallet? <laughs> <laughs> I, I like to think that the, the arcane symbol that was carved into my forehead was 29.9% APR. I attempt to dispel the darkness that fills my thoughts. You wish you had a dark pact then. You're like, please, no, could, could I please have a dark pack instead of 29.9% interest? And if I fail, I have no recollection. <laughs> oh, Jesus That is some bullshit. <laughs> Don't get me started on credit cards. Okay. Woo. That's a success. So I succeed. I get safe. rid of the debt. Woo. Okay. I roll a die on a one or two, discard this card. Uh-oh. Good. Yay. Okay, and what, what do you have to do? The same, same thing, thing yeah. with my blessed condition. Yeah. Yes! I can't you don't lose it. Okay, blessed. great. Okay. Oh, that was we, close. Uh, debt okay. condition goes away. All right, each investigator may gain a debt condition to discard one condition. Are you gonna go into debt to get rid of your leg injury? <laughs> <laughs> yes! Absolutely yes. I will, I will find that bloody contract. You have to invest in yourself. Yes. Health is the most important thing. It's it's self-maintenance, really. Self-care. <laughs> All right, so um, now, guess what, everybody? We've solved the mystery! Yay! Hurrah! You know, it might look like 
I wasn't directly involved in solving this mystery. But, you know, I like to think that I'm really the heart of the team. A lot of people look at me and they're like, there's a hobo looking guy in a sewer with a gammy leg. But really, I'm the team's heart. Let's bring out the new mystery. Omen of devastation. The nemesis moon appears in the night sky, visible to all and heralding an imminent doom. When an investigator closes a gate that corresponds to the current omen, he or she may spend one clue to place one Eldritch token on this card. At the end of the Mythos phase, if there are Eldritch tokens on this card equal to half the number of investigators solve the mystery. Okay, that's not the worst thing in the world. No. This is fine. We don't have any gates right now with so the current, that's, but the yeah, next one so we do. The next one, and the next one we have two. Sick. Oh, we are once again tantalizingly close to maybe having something good happen for us. We have two gates on the board uh, that are going to match the next omen symbol. We have enough players, maybe close enough to get to those gates to close them. We have a tiny window in time where we can close these gates before something happens and we've got to go all the way around and by then we're totally screwed. Is there any way that we can get to both of them? Why is the world, she can, she can get to the that world one. so big? We just have to hope that the Mythos card is not something that's like, oh, and uh, by the way, uh, you're f Go ahead, what are you gonna do? What are your actions? And it is a city, so you can shop. We're gonna go yeah. shopping. Shop it up. With our six. We've got one. Plus a reroll. No. So we get so one. You can find the bandages. Ooh, I'll take That's it. That's good. I don't have, I don't need to recover Ooh. anything, so Ooh. I'll just take a ticket, thank you to travel. Okay, so I wanna to try to get this clue that's on the space. Uh -huh. So I mm -hmm. think I should recover and try to buy stuff. Good idea. Sweet. Um, so you're gonna rest. I got nothing, <laughs> I'm gonna rest. I will Oh take... man, you're not even legs anymore. I know, I've, I've, oh, I'm man. having an identity crisis Remember when he was without Professor that. Legs and that was like his whole thing? I move, I, I take a boat. Yeah. What I kind of want to do is go to Istanbul because it gives me a chance, uh, Istanbul or Shanghai, because they give me a chance to improve. Yeah, so I'm gonna go this way. I'm gonna test my tome. That'd be great. Tome test, but I get to reroll and I continue to have all kinds of fails. So that's neat. You attend a reading by Edward Pickman Derby. I love readings. From his book, Azatoth and Other Horrors. <gasps> and ask him about the occult with your influence. <gasps> yes, my favorite. Tell me about the occult. Well, I would love to tell you a thing or 12 or 100 about the occult. Oh, well, uh, tell no. me. Well, this is what you need to know about the occult. Mm. Gain this clue! Woo! Yes! Let's yes, I got. See if I don't throw a clue in the garbage. <laughs> <laughs> the university allows you to use its telescope to search for signs of a green comet. Observation minus one. Definitely safer than surgery. Oh. Hey, use the right end Woo! of the telescope. <laughs> I know how to look at things. <laughs> you gain this clue and an additional clue. <gasps> yeah! oh! I just got two clues. That's like exactly how it was the turn before this when I made all the terrible mistakes and I gambled everything away because someone told me to. We're back where we were a turn ago. <laughs> <laughs> Pretend that never happened. Okay, leggy McLegs a lot. In an ancient underground chamber, you study strange scientific and magic paraphernalia once used by the Serpent Men. Oh, those guys. Use your lore. Yes. You manipulate the devices to transform yourself and gain a blessed condition. What? Yeah. Uh, all right, so I am, I think I'm gonna go ahead and encounter this wilderness. Far from any road or village, you find a shallow grave marked oh, I love them. only with an arcane symbol. Uh -huh. As you dig, a growing dread weakens your resolve. Uh, this is growing dread is one of my one of my weaknesses. <laughs> Test your will. Oh, I all kinds of pass. All kinds nice. of pass. If you pass, you find a charred corpse clutching a journal. Okay. Gain one clue or improve. <gasps> Lore. 
I'm improving my lore. I'm improving my lore. I'm improving my lore. I'm improving my you lore. I'm improving plus my lore. Two up because your special ability. Oh yeah, that's right. Because yes! I can improve it immediately. Improve again. She has the ability to study well and uh, and and end up being a, a pretty powerful force, provided she stays alive. At the market, you learn that another group of men have been asking about the same lost temple. You hope you get there first. Ongoing rumor. Investigators cannot resolve expedition encounters. As an encounter, an investigator on the active expedition space may attempt to uncover secrets lost to time and history with observation. If he or she passes, he or she may spend clues equal to half the people in the game to solve this rumor. <sighs> Reckoning effect. Search the expedition encounter deck for each card corresponding to the active expedition and return those cards to the game box. Then, if the expedition encounter deck is empty, investigators lose the game. Oh. Whoa. Wait. So it turns out that maybe we do want to go to the heart of Africa. I want to eventually get to help solve this. You want to close Arkham, is that what yeah. you're saying? So you want to move to San Francisco? I think I'll go there and go shopping. Yeah. Stack up. Oh, oh my God. I think that's... I am wealthy because the fours are, are blessed. Yeah. I, I know I have five, but I think the monster takes precedence for the rumor. I think you're right. So yeah. whoever fights it won't have to fight the monster also. The monster's yeah. gone. So monster's yep. gone. I think that's Goodbye. Great. Goodbye, Ketonian. We didn't like you anyway. Bad. Yeah, nice work. All right, I think I should rest and then move to Arkham. Super, all right. I Doctor. will spend my boat and then end up over there. Sweet. And then I totally need to recover. And because the witch doctor's my buddy, I get an extra health. Oh, that's nice. great. Nice. Yep. Um, and I am going to travel to Shanghai. One boat ticket, please. That's good. Thank you very much. You are invited to the Hearst Castle <gasps> and find yourself surrounded by the best and brightest. You may become delayed to stay for a few days. Can you just like hang out by the little boy who pees? <laughs> like that's my favorite Hearst Castle thing. I'm a classy gal, that's not really my vibe. I think it's too important to stop right now. My destiny calls. I have to save the world. All right, fight this monster. Okay, so will check, so two. And oh, yeah. you all kinds I of fast. I mean, okay. Flying colors. I'm gonna power up my strength. So uh, I can test my lore. I only get one success. One, one is probably enough. No, it's not enough. <laughs> <laughs> the spell's dark energy. It turns energy. out the book is made of dynamite. <laughs> <laughs> the spell's dark energy turns against you. Oh, Lord. <laughs> Flooding my mind with madness. Well, that's a familiar place. <laughs> Discard this card unless you lose to sanity. I'm glad I healed up. So now I'm plus six for strength. Yay. Uh, that's, uh, that's two, two, success. two uh, punches on him. Yep. Yeah. If you defeat this monster during a combat encounter, you can take a dark pact condition to discard one monster from any space. <gasps> I don't, dark pact doesn't sound fun. Everyone says I shouldn't, but hello. Inlet, you I mean, are a former oh, cultist, so. It doesn't sound I mean. fun. I'm not even wearing a shoe right now. Why would you trust me? I'm taking it. I want to take, right. take a dark pact. I knew you wanted to take a dark pact. I want to take a dark pact. In game terms, there's no real advantage to taking that dark pact. In narrative terms, it's perfect and wonderful and amazing. It is exactly what the reform cultist would do. I love that Jessica has committed to this part of her character because it's going to make the game more interesting. In the restricted section of Miskatonic University's library, you study an esoteric tome. Gain one incantation spell. So just wait, I just get it straight up top of the deck. Nice, you get it. So miss of how would you say this? Rella? Mists the mists of uh, Rue, Ray, Rila. The mists of Rue. Yeah. 
Okay. Um, you're, I noticed that you're still holding that card. I am still holding Poochie, this card. you look like you have something to say. Oh, no. You try to decode a note written in the margin, because you can't help yourself. Roll your lore. Okay. That's a couple of successes. Yeah. That's two success. You succeed, and uh, it's just, it's a little picture of a fluffy kitten. Um, professor, doctor? I will encounter the city. An old Aboriginal man is on trial for a murder that you know he didn't commit. You I agree? was in the sewers and I saw the actual <laughs> real killers. You agree to testify to prove his innocence, so use your influence. <laughs> well, actually. <laughs> yes! yes! That's great. Yes! <laughs> I don't want to succeed on the well, actually. <laughs> speaks to the spirits on your behalf. Oh. And you get a blessed condition. <gasps> Double oh, blessed! So, so you, I believe you flip it over. If you would have got, if you get another condition, I think you flip it over and something good happens. Flip hold it. on, hold on. Flip this card instead doesn't, uh, I don't like that. It, it could be double good or double bad. Is anything in this game double good? Uh, nope, Ooh. maybe. In your dreams, a handsome youth shows <laughs> me visions of faraway places and the secrets that are hidden there. Gain two clues and flip this card. And so I keep <laughs> you got blessed you got and I get two. You had a real fun dream. You have delusions of great. grandeur. That was amazing. I don't, I don't know what's happening. Yay. That's great. I'm going to encounter Shanghai. The shrine holds an abundance of ancient relics. Im That's why I went there. Improve lore. Really? Your eye catches strange figures written on the ceiling. You find it hard to look away. Observation. Test your I'm not doing anything. No, I'm not, this doesn't happen. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, happen. test your will. <laughs> will. Whoa. You must test your will. She's the mom voice on you. <laughs> All right, I passed. Do I get something? No. Okay, great. It just would have been bad news bears. When you get there, stop at this address. The nervous little man hands you a business card for a restaurant. Ask for the catch of the day, and then tuck a sawbuck into your napkin. These guys can get you the answers you need. When you get the bill for your meal, it includes directions to a payphone. It's already ringing by the time you find it. You answer and explain your situation to the gruff voice on the other end of the line. The lead investigator tests influence well. and gains a number of clues equal to her test results. Look. No. Oh my god. We are gonna be fantastic. Also, I just wanna show that this is a thing that we might oh need to start worrying God. about. I'm feeling really good about the Doom track. People have been dying, we're not wounded, we're not gimped up or cursed. And then he goes, by the way, the game is going to end in seven turns no matter what. Yeah. At the end of this turn, I think we can solve this mystery. We're still okay. Okay, we all can. Right. We got really lucky with those gates being the right types, but if we miss this turn, it's gonna be four more turns before it comes around. And I'm pretty sure we will lose the game if we have to wait all of that time for it to get around. Yep, we can. You just okay. need to defeat two monsters in a I, gate. I'm, I got it. All right, yeah. Okay. I'm gonna get as many clues as possible. Go, three, re because I have the blessed condition. And don't you get to re-roll because to re you have a thing that lets you re-roll yes. lore? Yep. Yeah. Okay. And you get one extra die Did you as take your special action. Per turn, yep. No. And All I right. really like you. You just roll it. <laughs> so you get three you clues. Three clues. I'm so three good. Clues. Dude, awesome, huh? Steph. So you go so, to his gate. I'll go to her gate. So we're doubled up on opportunity. Just right. in case. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to travel to Indonesia, which I don't like, and boat myself to Sydney, which I hear is lovely this time of year. We'll just okay. say that I tomed before I, I left okay. Shanghai. That's three successes, so I did that, was great. I can spend a sanity to gain two clues. I'll do that. Um, and your two actions, uh, Miss Lola. I am going to get a travel ticket. A boat ticket, I presume? No, we're going to rail. Okay, and where, to where are you railing? I'm railing right over to where Jess slash Diana is. In Arkham, great. Sure. Yeah, to attack. Jess. Okay, I can't rest, so. Oh, what you could do, if you pop that cultist mm -hmm. with an action, then you could rest, because he'd be gone. <gasps> oh, yes! that's right! You're so smart! 
Wow! Get rid of this guy, and now I'm now I rest. So long, jerk. Get out of here. When I perform a rest action, I may test my lore. If I pass, I gain one spell. Sweet. There you oh go. yeah, you did. Shriveling. Test lore. If you pass, choose a monster on your space to lose two health. Yep. Cool. Nice. Uh, doctor, professor. Doctor, professor. Professor, doctor, doctor. I'm going to spend two clues. Yeah. To discard a monster on a space containing a gate. Whoa! Which, which one are you going to get rid of? Monster. This I think one, one this of them is four. super awful. Well, I think probably the number one. four is going to go away. Yeah. Uh, so with my nice extra work. turn, so can I grab a a <laughs> ticket? Yeah, you can. I think that's my only other good preparatory thing. Okay, so the first thing I do is uh, I have a sanity test. I'm not sure if uh, Flying Fists of Fury is really gonna be useful against uh, Amigo or uh, a Shoggoth or, or, or any of the other nameless horrors that crawl through portals. Uh, but the important thing is Lily doesn't know that. Here we Do go, it. here we go. Now I'm gonna strength my strength up. Okay, hang on, here we go, ready? Do, 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 I've got strength. Mm. Everything's cool, you guys. I get uh. to reroll a die one round for yeah. a reason. You can do it. <gasps> you got it! Yeah. All right, it's I gone, okay. It. Go away, I yeah. don't want you around anymore. And now. You find yourself standing in front of antique scientific equipment. Mm -hmm. According to the papers, the year is 1771. You read through the notes and try to interpret the nature of the experiments using lore. Oh, 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 oh. So good. Joseph Kerwin was using this lab to revive dead wizards from their ashes Kerwin. and interrogate them for arcane knowledge. Oh, using okay, his yeah. notes, you close this gate. Yeah! Yes! The rest of his results may also prove useful. You may become delayed to gain one spell. I mean, okay, now hang on. First of all, there you go. Bop, bop, turns yes. into that, so That's great. that can go. Uh -huh. I'm not gonna lie, this feels really good <laughs> right now, uh, and um, I kind of like, you know, did it with one of the other players kind of like being on the same space as me. And you know, Lily likes to talk about how she like doesn't need anybody's approval, but she kind of does a little bit. So um, I, uh, I don't, I kind I really want that, but I think that I shouldn't do it so that I can get a move on to the heart of Africa. And it sets um, us for the future. Uh, what are you gonna do there, madam? I'm gonna fight this gate. You discover a waxen mask and artificial hands. Your mind reels as you realize that the old man you had spoken to earlier was actually some terrible creature disguised as a human. Please make a will test. Good oh, thing. Oh, that's three successes. Oh, yes, that's true. We're blessed. You realize now that the old man's words carry a secondary meaning. You attempt to decrypt what he said with your lore. And fours count, so mm -hmm. odds are could, we get could the be better. snake eyes. And yeah. uh, we're gonna do one more reroll. Oh no, so we can't close Lola, this Lola, what's oh. going on? Now you could spend clues for additional rerolls. Yeah, right. spend it, reroll. Ha! There we, we did go. Sweet, sweet. You understand the man's implied instructions. Yes, we do. Close the gate. Lola's comeback to her is kind of amazing. She's on this motivational speaking tour of Europe and Asia and now America. Um, she's really inspiring the world to get out there and stop being crazy. So then I take this, <clears throat> I put it here, I turn Does it, it turn into, into a thing? It turns into a thing. And then, if we reach the end of the mythos phase, we've solved this mystery. Well, what maybe are you I should. Maybe I should go after this clue then. Inside a warehouse. Zoinks! Yep. Oh, thank you. This is what we need. Uh, you hear a clanging sound and discover a creature that resembles a metallic crate. Walking around on several legs. You try to follow the thing back to the cult's lair. So observation minus one. Let's go after the tripod monster. Are you blessed? No. That's not good. 
Nothing bad happens, though. Uh, okay, old man beards a lot. Is there a sewer in Sydney? I'm, oh, you yeah, know what? Maybe there is. There's I'm, only one way to find I'm out. I'm kind of hoping. You just run through it. You enter a sewer. No. <laughs> <laughs> You dream of crossing a vast desert hunted by an enormous wing creature. In this dream, you turn to face your fears with will. Okay. Will you roll the dice? That's all I got. <laughs> okay, so <laughs> you wake up feeling more alive than ever. Improve your strength. I, I improve my strength? <laughs> wow. After the noise and violence is over, one of the shopkeepers peers out from his shuttered windows. Amazed to see you alive, he opens the window and calls out, Is it over? Are we safe? You wave to let him know that everything is fine. Reckoning. This rumor is a way more dangerous ticking time bomb than anything else. Search the expedition encounter deck for each card corresponding oh, to the active expedition. Right. And that rumor, nobody is close to. So the active expedition is the heart of Africa. So we lose that, okay. And now, if this now gets the expedition down to zero. moves. Oh. So that could continue to be super bad news bears for us. Right. Well, I have uh, right. we'll start with me, because I'm first. Uh -oh. So no I, roll, I roll about my boon. Yes! Okay, I succeeded. Woohoo! Okay, anybody else? I got Reckoning. my blessed roll your, condition. Roll for your blessed condition. Ah! Okay, you I, have a reckoning? Yeah, with my dark pact. Oh, your dark pact. No! Holy sh! The dark pact has come due. The only one I didn't need to get was I couldn't get a one, and I got a one! But it's kind of great that you got a dark <laughs> pact. Yeah, he's uh, eagerly loving. Tell it. us what happened with your dark pact, not a cultist. <laughs> wink. Time to fulfill my part of the bargain. Oh no. The chanting reaches a fever pitch. The cult leader places a ritual dagger in your hand, my hand, and tells me, the time has come. You must pay the blood you owe to the children of the black goat. Oh no! Oh no. If I'm being honest, I never thought that anything bad would ever happen to me or my friends through my actions of being a cultist and taking a dark pact. What do you do? What do you do? Uh, and that's the end of Tim Top, goodbye! <laughs> <laughs> what do you do? That's the... Yeah. What do you do? Jess may need some time in the asylum too. Did wonders. Look, I know Do that you stab somebody? I think I'm gonna become reformed now. Why are you I'm, looking at me? <laughs> we talked I, about this. I think I learned my lesson with dark packs. There's a difference between a cultist and a reformed cultist and somebody who says they're a reformed cultist because if you're still wearing the robes and you're still dealing with dark arts. I've got to kill someone. Oh, what? And you're still killing folks in blood rituals. I'm just saying maybe reformed has a different meaning. I mean, I don't kill them, do I? Don't, I mean, it's just like manslaughter, if anything. Typical Jess. You actually kill? It's just as kill for kill kill? This is, this is brutal. <laughs> Another investigator of my choice is devoured by the black goat monster. <laughs> of your choice. Oh. Okay. Wait, let me, let me see this here. I'm like gonna reform for real, I'm sorry. I trust a reform. Oh. I'm like gonna do better next time. Look, I think in game terms and narrative terms, Dr. Professor Dr. Norman Professor has got to go. I mean, and just in-, in I, I have a rich character history. I'm the plucky underdog. I'm the soul of this team. You're the underdog? Yes. I finally have fixed my leg, right? I'm blessed. You know, I've got the Necronomicon. I'm kind of moving up in the world. Norman is on the verge of flowering as a character. Who's gonna uh, telegraph you girls' orders if I am not in the picture anymore? My God, he called us girls. <laughs> and he just called us girls? Oh, he's dead. He is all kinds of dead. Stab him to death with your dark dagger of dark daggering. I was on the verge of being competent. I think we gotta kill you. I choose Norman. One. I've never seen his leg. I have no idea if it exists. It's probably just a bottle of whiskey. I was just, I'm really, I'm, I just, I need a moment. Are you blessed at all? <laughs> yes. Oh. That's why everything I say is so super fucking charming. I think I'm doing everyone a service. In terms of the overall game, it was perfect. I could not be 
I could not be happier. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Like, so so here's what happens. I want I want to be the sailor. Here's what happens. I want to be the sailor. Plan anything in the Cthulhu universe, you know that you could die at the drop of a hat. And I had my eye on Silas right from the beginning. Have you seen the picture of the sailor? Of course I want to be the sailor. Like, mm. Super hunky. <sighs> Like, we won't kill the sailor. Oh, look at this See, guy. she never would have offed him. <laughs> I just need a minute. Oh, wow. His leg injury is just that he's got it tucked down and one leg of his pants. And the sailor even starts in Sydney. If you fail as the old beardy, crazy astronomer lore master, then you come in as the buff, shirtless, bra sailor boy. I'm just gonna roll up my sleeves because it is warm in here. This is the most handsome cartoon card guy I've ever seen. <laughs> I might not be a movie star, but I will do anything you tell me to do. Just remember that. I might look sweaty right now, but this is what you call the vapors. <laughs> <laughs> I'm still not wearing a shoe. Like me, please. He doesn't need to go through my personal assistant. Uh, he also doesn't need to add more layers of clothing. If I looked like Silas, you would have to pay me to put on clothes. And we have to advance the doom track because someone was devoured. <laughs> Worth it. <laughs> 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 Who knew that making a deal with the devil could turn out good? Event, the lead investigator gains one random ally from the deck. And you get, as if it's not sexy enough on the table right now, <laughs> some oh. hired muscle. No oh, way. Oh. Yes. Helps your strength out. And that ends the mythos phase, which means... Whoop. We've solved our second mystery. Yeah. So I helped solve the first mystery, and I thought, great, this is an awesome comeback. But then I helped solve the second mystery, and I'm thinking, this is my thing. I'm gonna solve every mystery. Um, <laughs> let's find out what our new mystery is. Go ahead, Steph. The true name. Fragments of Azathoth's true name exist in long forgotten tombs. It is said that if a person speaks his name aloud three times, the blasphemous sound will grant the speaker great power. Oh my God, he's like a reverse Bloody Mary. Yes. Yeah. Yes. That's one. When, <laughs> when this card enters play, place a number of Eldritch tokens equal to half the number of players, each yep. on a random space. Yeah. Okay, uh-huh. Uh, one space. on 21, right above Sydney. One in San Francisco. Okay. Ooh. As an encounter, an investigator on a space containing an Eldritch token may attempt to find information about Azathoth's true name. He may spend two clues to place that Eldritch token on this card. At the end of this mythos phase, if there are Eldritch tokens on this equal to half the number of players, solve this mystery. We got super lucky with our placement yeah. and the fact that everybody's all okay. clue heavy. Stocked okay. up on clues. Oh my God. So I might. think it's just an issue of making it happen. We have gotten incredibly lucky two times in this game. In the beginning, our Mythos deck did not punch us in the face too badly. And now, with our final mystery to solve, we are one movement action away from completing the mystery. Unless there's something terrible on the Mythos card, or I, we spontaneously combust and die, we're looking at actually winning this game. Gimpy McBeard's a lot fell yeah. falls over. Yeah. And and Dirk Strongjaw here <laughs> just steps over his body and says, Well, hello. Norman was really invested in saving the world. Silas kind of like wandered on stage and there's like hot women, you know, like kung fu and stuff. And so he's just like, like, okay. And Lily goes, oh, oh, oh. <laughs> You guys seem cool, I'll hang with you. I really don't think Silas understood what was going on at all. I don't think he cares. He just thought that there was gonna be a party after this. Oh, that's fantastic. Oh my God. All right, everybody, for my action, I am gonna hump Dirk Strong a lot. With, between that missionary and your hired muscle, I think we got a party. 
<laughs> I think I'll rest. I mean, I think that's probably just the best thing for me to do is rest. Um, and then I'll just move. All right, Steph. So I will take a train ticket yep. and yep. then I will spend it. Yep. And I'll take the northern route this time through Chicago. Nice. Now you've yeah. seen all of America. I've seen yeah. all of America. The leaves I mean, are that's kind of great. Yeah. yeah. What is uh, Murdy McStabberton going to be doing over there with the uh, dark pact o Satanism? It's gone. Yeah. I'm totally going to be reformed now oh. for sure, Z's. <laughs> oh, God. I, we lost the Necronomicon, too. I don't know about this now. <laughs> I mean, should I come here? Did over you just here? mourn the book that I had instead of. Dude, did you see you? <laughs> I mean, come on. You know, Norman was not was not a respected member of the team. He he reeked of 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 kind of mushroom and 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 sadness. I think I should come help you just in case, right? So I will need uh, one there preparation to travel, and then I want to travel. Mm -hmm. Boom! Nice. There you go. Now we're okay. here. Uh, and uh, <laughs> hey, Silas, what's going on? Uh, well, man. <laughs> well, ma'am. <laughs> please, uh, please, don't. Call me anything. <laughs> Please, <laughs> stop using your words. Don't use your. I, I don't want. I don't want you to use your words. If you could communicate by flexing your, your pecs in Morse code, that would be great. You don't stand on the prow of your ship with your arms crossed in a certain way, you know, kind of flexing, showing off your tattoo and your hair. That doesn't happen by accident. Dude's a player. Uh, I will actually travel up to be to be by Lily <laughs> for no oh. tactical advantage. Close just to be close. Together. Yeah, Lily's super oh. okay with this. And yep. uh, and oh. as it turns out, so am I. Yep. Well, I'm, I'm shipping this. This is a match Oh, made I ship this so hard. <laughs> like my parents. <laughs> what? That's what your dad looks like? Whoa, your dad looks like that? <laughs> I, listen, I think one of the most wonderful things to come out of this game is that uh, we've helped Steph uncover a huge portion of her heritage. I'm going to encounter <laughs> Uh, Ooh, pick me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna spend two clues to uh, encounter that Eldritch token and place it on the uh, the the it's true fine. name. And uh, what will you do? I will also encounter yeah. that token, that mm -hmm. Eldritch token. And now we have two on here. So if we make it okay. to the end of this Mythos phase. Mm -hmm. If, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. we'll see. We have okay. seen card effects that, that are like, hey, oh, yeah. solve you're done. mystery Put a solve thing back in the thing, yeah. 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 I could use my oh, mists. You're right. To try to do the encounter as if there's no monster here. Yeah. Um, Ooh. You get, you Lots got of win. I walk forward boldly, knowing the mist will keep me hidden. No additional effect. Oh, all right. Nice. Perfect. The spirit of your departed companion stares at you judgmentally. <laughs> <laughs> Not really. Not really. That was great. I wish you hadn't have bailed out when you did. You could have made her do all kinds of tests and things. Oh, I should. Oh, you could have made her. Oh. Through the slits in the closet door, you see yourself as a small child sitting up in bed. Who's there? asks a frightened voice. You try to calmly persuade your younger self that you are a friend. It's uh, it's influence minus one. This is your wheelhouse. Okay, look. If I'm a reform cultist, that means I was a cultist, which means I had some pretty messed up things happen to me for me to have like absolutely no will. So I'm assuming my childhood is like really dark. And no, awful. she's there. It's it. She's got a pink like puppy dog quilt on the bed, ponytails. You don't remember any of this. She's adorable. <gasps> you succeeded. I succeeded. The child What's calms that? down, but eyes you suspiciously <laughs> because you're not an idiot. And I drop the dagger on the ground. <laughs> Listen Nothing. carefully to what I say, you tell yourself. It might save your life. In the future, you will meet a man with a beard. <laughs> <laughs> he will smell vaguely of sewers and desperation. <laughs> Kill him, kill him, kill him. Done! Uh, you gain two clues. Wow, wow nice! Yes. And you close the gate, and I, I presume? Close yep. It. Okay, Silas, uh, anything you see that you'd like to uh, encounter? Uh, okay. Lore, lore, lore. The remains of a long dead explorer lie before you. 
<laughs> oh, what did you mind. do? Um, uh, <laughs> Some of his gear still seems solid. to bury an old body. <laughs> and you won't miss it. You dig through the dead man's pockets. Gross. Gain one random item. Oh, okay. Uh, and then you lose one sanity. I get a lucky cigarette case. Yeah, the lucky cigarette container is the best. He can't wear it in his vest pocket, so it stops the bullet. That's, boy. And you see there's a bullet hole in it. You're like, of course you have your lucky cigarette case. Of course it goes in your, in your, you, you know. You, Silas better hope that he has bulletproof packs is all I'm saying. Okay, he's... It goes in his cod piece. <laughs> <laughs> and Lily's decided to take up smoking. <laughs> <laughs> Gang, we've come to the mythos phase. The scope of the tremor was so vast that newspapers in every country reported on the damage done and the tragic destruction of ancient wonders. The world shakes. Each investigator on the active expedition space or an adjacent space loses two health and becomes delayed. Then, search the expedition encounter deck for each card corresponding to the active expedition and return it to the game box. Then shuffle the expedition encounter deck. <laughs> um, that's the end of the mythos phase. At the end of the mythos phase, if there are eldritch tokens on this card equal to half the number of players, solve this mystery. We saved the world, you guys! <laughs> we did it! Yes! Yeah! yeah. <laughs> we saved the world, even though it looked like we weren't for a while. <laughs> now, this is the point on tabletop where generally the winners, or in this case, the winning team, get to make a victory speech. But in place of a victory speech, Pat is going to tell us why Silas wears an eye patch. I was in Sydney. Yeah. And we're on a ship. Mm -hmm. And then uh, there was a blood moon. Yep. And then out of the water, uh, unspeakable evil. And then out of the sky, unspeakable evil. And, uh, and then through a portal. Speakable evil, but bad. Yeah. You know? Yeah, and, yeah. and then after I took care of that, I was opening a bottle of champagne and. Just right in oh, there. Oh man, it hurt like the Dickens. No. Did you want to stab him? <laughs> I mean, I didn't know if I wanted to stab him or kiss it all better, so. Yeah, that's a tough. Well, listen, I want you all to ponder that, and uh, we'll wait for Pat to write the resolution eventually. Thank you all very much for watching. Uh, thanks for uh, uh, playing this game with me, you guys. This was really, really fun. We spent a whole day doing this, and it was great. Um, so until next time, be nice to each other, and uh, play more games. Let's awkwardly walk off stage together, guys. Oh, yeah. Yeah, okay. I don't know what to do with my arms now. I, like I know, it's weird, right? <laughs>